for straight up skating, I thought this would be good. It feels comfortable. It kind of feels like those old vans from when I was in middle school used to feel. These are gonna skate really good. I can already tell. They kind of remind me of the Vans Wavy that I had. Just the way it's cut in the front. Yeah, those are definitely going to feel great. They're very comfortable. I like the thick padded tongue. Yeah, I like everything about these. I miss having a soft, flexible shoe like this. It's just, it's just comfortable to wear. All right, so these are the steel toe shoes that I have. It's probably some kind of composite. It doesn't feel like it's getting you know, too cold or anything. They're kind of thick. They've got a lot of padding, so I'm not gonna be able to feel the board very much, but I'll try to skate these first. So just rolling around on the board, I can tell there's definitely a possibility for rolling my ankles in these. So maybe we should take it easy, go to the mini ramp first, see how that works out. So far, I am pleasantly surprised with these. They're really grippy, but they're definitely grippier than any of my skate shoes. They feel kind of like the Michelin tire version of the Etnies Muranas. So yeah, so far they actually feel pretty solid, especially in the mini ramp. So I definitely could get used to these. I just don't have a lot of board feel with these. I actually didn't have any insoles in the shoe, but it's still really thick. And that toe box is so thick, it just feels a little weird on the flick. It's definitely something that I could get used to if I really tried. The flip tricks were significantly harder just because it was so much different than what I'm used to. If you're somebody that does destroy the toe of your shoe really fast though, this could be a solution for sure for you. These shoes look nice, they feel really comfortable. So I guess I'll skate with them a little bit, see how that feels. So these definitely have a nicer, quicker flick. They're also very grippy and they need to be broken in because they're really stiff. Both of these shoes definitely make these trucks feel looser than the thin broken in shoes I was skating. When you're getting used to new shoes and you kind of have a little bit looser trucks, it makes them feel even looser. So yeah, uh, it feels like I got really grippy shoes and a really squirrely board, if that makes any sense. I could definitely see these hurting my Achilles tendon a little bit. It just popped uh, if they don't break in. But I think they will break in, get a little softer. There's like a real hard edge to the shoes and some people might like that for flip tricks or some people might not like that. I just kind of slipped them on, kind of like people used to do with DCs and shoes back in the early 2000s. So yeah, I think they look kind of cool. They definitely look retro like a 2003 shoe now i tried tying them really tight and that feels like a totally different shoe see if that skates any different it's a warm shoe thick canvas and suede i feel like wheels and bushings definitely feel harder when it's cold outside especially these dragon wheels like i feel like i'm riding some spitfires or something today they do not feel soft today So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you like this kind of content, scroll through my channel, check out my other videos, and hit that subscribe button because I got a lot more videos to come. Thanks for watching.